Fall Armyworm, an American pest, is threatening food security in Africa. The fall armyworm represents a major threat to food security, health, and livelihoods in Africa. Native to the American tropics, it was first detected in Africa in 2016 and is now threatening more than 300 million African farmers who depend on corn for food and income. While the fall armyworm can feed on more than 80 species of plants, its preferred host is corn, which accounts for around half of caloric intake in eastern and southern Africa. The pest could cause extensive corn yield losses, estimated at between U.S. $76 million and $191 million in Zimbabwe alone. The pest can also provide a pathway for the growth of fungi-producing substances that are dangerous to the health of both humans and animals. The fall armyworm may have arrived by ship to Africa, where it has few natural enemies. The fall armyworm multiplies quickly. It is a highly reproductive species with the female moth able to lay a thousand eggs in her lifetime. It also spreads quickly. The moth can fly up to 100 kilometers in a single night. Moreover, the fall armyworm is highly resistant to pesticides. Today, 44 out of 54 African states and territories have already reported infestations of the pest. Faced with such an ordeal, smallholder farmers are desperate, and some of them are already resorting to highly hazardous pesticides. In America, farmers have adopted genetically modified crops resistant to the fall armyworm, but this solution is unlikely to be adopted in Africa, both because of its cost and because they are banned in many African countries. African governments are also stepping up their efforts to fight the pest, but are hindered by their own lack of experience and resources. International organizations such as FAO and USAID are also involved, providing a variety of projects and programs aimed mainly at training farmers and authorities on how to identify and eliminate the pest using agronomic techniques and local remedies, as well as coordinating efforts on the continent. Failing to deal with the pest could have wide-ranging economic, environmental, and humanitarian consequences.